Simply Sammy, and um, I'm Samantha, and this is my page. Uh, to my returning friends, hi, welcome back. Thanks for joining us again. And to my new friends, hi, welcome. I hope you like what you see and you decide to stay. So if you are new, my page is about the home building process. Well, actually it's not anymore. We just finished the home building, so now, we're doing a house to home series and so I will be showing you how I updated the home and basically how we're making it home. So today's videos we'll be showing you we did get a new couch for the living room and um, I'll show you the basement, what we did in the basement. And um, in case you didn't see, I did finally get lights for my office. So um, yep, so that's it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoy. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks so much. Bye. Hi, guys. So as you can see, we have a new couch. I'm uh, very excited about this couch. We needed a couch that would fit the size of this room. So it took us a while to decide on what type of couch we wanted. Well, we knew we wanted a sectional, but we wanted one because we had one before. It was very small. We needed one. You know, like I said, fit size. So we decided on this one. Originally, we did decide on um, a different style couch, but it wasn't gonna be ready for was it, six months or something. It wouldn't have been here until February, possibly. So we asked them what they had in stock. This is Jubilee, by the way, which their customer service seems very good. But they, um, they sent us three other styles that was similar to the one that we chose and said we have these in stock so we got this so we wanted one this is a dual power reclining couch it's um genuine leather genuine italian leather and we got it from jubilee and um yeah it, it came pretty came within what does it take like a month i think when it was in stock maybe yeah well three weeks possibly but um, this right here reclines, and they kind of like hide the recline buttons. Like it's here. Let me see, it goes all the way out. And it goes all the way back. It's very comfortable. Like you can sleep on this and be fine. Like this, this is, it's very comfortable. Yeah, the only complaint I have is that they could have put it on the outside of the chair. That might have been a little easier, but it's fine. And so this one reclines, this one reclines, and this one reclines, and this one reclines. One of our things that we wanted was to be sure to have a couch with four recliners. So me, hubs, and the kids could all sit and be comfortable watching TV or whatever together. So they're not fighting over, you know, oh, I want the one that reclines, I want this. So although we did get to, we thought, you know, they'd sit here, we sit there and watch TV. They don't want to sit next to each other, of course. So, um, but we are going to get another one of these and um, have it put in between these. So, um, but that's going to be, um, they have to, if that was a custom order, so that'll take, who knows when I'll be here, probably February or something. But the part, one thing that we like about this, this is a wireless, uh, charger. So all you have to do is put your phone right there and it even works for phone cases. I was surprised about that. I did not know I never had, um, one of the wireless chargers that just sits here. So that you just put your phone there. And it charges. That's awesome. Okay, and so you open it up, and we have this two USB ports and two other outlets right here, and you know, space to put anything. I think the should go in there. There, you have this to that, and you have a space to fit your drinks. So this is like really really nice it's awesome we originally I did want to get white but we thought it would be a little 
to um, too hard to keep clean since this was like the main area for people would come to visit and stuff. You know, we're gonna sit here, kids eat, and you know, it's just easier to get a gray couch so at least we can allow the kids to sit on it. But um, yes, so we got this. Uh, we're gonna have, you know, a rug and um, end table, not end table, what do you call it? Fluffy table and stuff. And we'll get that. And once those come in, I will be sure to let y'all know. And um, I guess that's it for the couch. Okay, but before I show you the laundry room, this is what the couch looks like from up here. All right. So this is the laundry room. It's nothing spectacular, but it's complete. So we'll show you. Well, we do want to get a um, rug or something. This is laundry. Uh, this is laundry. I like my decals. And I got this. I thought this was cute, so I had to get it. But so we have um, the LG Think Cute. And Think Q uh, means that they have a lot of appliances, I think, that are Think Q. And they all go, and you can all attach them to an app. And they'll tell you, this is a smart washer and smart dryer. It tells you when your clothes is done washing and when your clothes is done drying. Um, it tells you when the washing machine or the dryer needs to be cleaned. and. Um, when it needs to be serviced, it, it tells you all that and keeps track of everything, so that's nice. And um, we did get extra. This is called a sidekick. We got this, and what this does is it's a like a little baby washing machine. So if you don't have a full load of laundry to do, you just have a small load, maybe a kid's uniform or something, you can just put it in there and wash it without doing a full load. So that is pretty neat. And um, yeah, so show you what it looks like inside. It's the regular washing machine. And the dryer, let me show you. It's the sound it makes. And dryer, it's a lint trap right there. I mean, y'all have seen dryers before. Yep, and yep. Hubby did get these. Got this. I thought those are cute. He got that. Did good. And I went over here for um, things behind the pockets. But, yeah, that's just our, um, what's it called? Uh, vacuum cleaner. And, yep. So that is the laundry room. Okay, so now I'll show you what we did. To the basement and make our we did put lights here that come on when you go down the stairs so here you see lights up the stairs but yep so this is what we have for the basement. Here, this is a little card table area and board games and DVDs and stuff. Hangout room. Piano. And here we go. And this is Hubby's little bar. And no, Hubby does not drink, but he wanted a bar. And got all these. And of course, all this lights up. So we'll put in a clip to show you that. And oh, and that's right, Hubby changed the counters up. I wanted to tape him doing that, but of course he just did it. And I came downstairs and was like, oh, okay then. You know, so YouTube is the reason why it's not, I didn't get it recorded. But yeah, so yeah, we didn't like the color of the counters before, so we changed them. 
but we are going to have to do something with this area here, um, whether it's a wine fridge or something, um, we'll do. But yeah, so we'll do that. Just show you everything. So that's what we did with the basement so far. You know. Yep, and we'll do a clip at night to show you everything that I'm <laughs>